satisfied till I clean my plate Up in the middle of the night, that's right, real late Midnight snacks, falling some chocolate I got some chocolate bars and my stars couldn't fit in any cars I'm feeling like I got a strike close, so I'm waiting for some pound chicka pound pounds Pound chicka pound pounds Yo, I'm gonna make it fresh to the death Veggies on my right, fruit on my left Chicken or fish, a good dish Eat some turkey, break a wishbone I'm not alone, but it's my own choice And I tell you with my own Let's voice break it, break it down now Make it happen somehow Some people think I'm funny But I'm about to get it done Rich, rich, bling, bling Rival flavin' in me Feeling good and now you see It's time to get healthy Come on, smell some white Come on, smell some white Time for sure, ma Ow, 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 ow Are you guys excited? I'm excited. Okay, check it out. I'm I'm excited for a lot of reasons, all right? Um, one, I got a new music player, an MP3 player that I can start listening to my music while I go on my runs. I'm super excited about that. I love running now. Um, my knees have just not collapsed on me. I don't know if you've seen some of my old videos. I've told you that when I was in the military, I ran so much and my knees started giving out all the time. I came out with a problem called PFPS. Uh, don't remember what it stands for exactly, but you can look it up or maybe I'll put something down below here. Um, but basically what it means is the cartilage in my knee was worn out and I couldn't run because it would, it would start rubbing bone to bone and it would hurt so bad. All right, But now I've been running and I've been feeling good and I've been losing weight. I've lost about 10 pounds this month already and I'm continuing on my good path of losing weight and staying excited. All right, so that's the reason my knees have not been hurting. Another reason I got my music player, so when I run I can listen to the, the nice jams that I want to listen to. Also, I've made a lot of really cool friends that I would have never known existed if I didn't start posting up these videos. Most of the people who watch my videos are people who also post videos as video responses, and you guys are amazing. You guys have been really supportive. I love the comments. Keep them coming. Um, I'm going to keep trying to watch your videos and making comments. Uh, I'm, I'm very busy all the time, so I'm sorry if I don't get to do all of them and comment to everybody. But I'm trying, and I love watching your videos. And keep it coming. Stay excited, because that's what's going to get you going. If you haven't committed yourself to losing weight yet, make that commitment. Put it down on a piece of paper. Write it down somewhere. Keep telling yourself you're committed. Get some friends that can help push you along because having people along with you in anything in life always makes it better. And you always want to do things that are better, right? Don't you? So, so keep it going. Keep, stay excited because that excitement is going gonna, is gonna to be what gets you through it. It's going to push you even when it's hard because after you, after you get through the hard stuff, you feel great. So keep that going and stay excited, be excited, be committed, not just interested and and stay in the stay in the game. Keep you know whatever your goals are, even if it's not losing weight. Stay excited about it. Pick things that you're excited about to be your goals because that's what's going to that's what's going to push you to the end. Is your excitement, your your feel, the vibe that you put through into it, everything about you that you gotta put into that goal, you just gotta do it. All right, stay excited. I'm gonna keep going, I'm gonna keep losing weight. I'm gonna stay in shape and I'm gonna start making more goals in my life. This, this kind of thing has got me going on making goals and learning how much I can accomplish just by putting my heart to it. Put everything that's inside of your heart into what you do and you'll do great. Keep it up you guys and we'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> And don't forget, you guys, September 21st is the deadline for the montage videos. I think I've got one in so far, just one. So put them all in, because if I don't get enough videos, is it going to be worth it for me to make a montage? It doesn't even make sense. If, it's, if there's not enough videos there, it can't be a montage. So get those videos in, send them over to me. You can send them over to me as a message and attach the video with a link. Uh, you can put it in Dropbox and send me the link. You can give me the the link to your video, whatever, however you want to get it to me. Just give me that video by the 21st and that'll be in the montage that I make. All right, here we go. All right, so for tonight's dinner, we're making some delicious 
tilapia fillets that we're gonna bake. And check it out. We're uh, we're seasoning them up now. We got six fillets of tilapia. Now over here we got a mixture of olive oil. You can use butter, but we like to use olive oil because it's more healthy. And it's got a nice little mix of seasonings. Uh, garlic, marjoram, ground mustard, basil leaves, oregano, and some um, some gro ground black pepper. And then we're going to mix up some uh, a cup and a half of chopped fresh chopped spinach, um, about a cup of panko flakes, and a few teaspoons or tablespoons of uh, parmesan. And then you just bake it at 400 degrees for 15 minutes. And here is the end result. Here we go. This is going in the oven. Meals, meals, meals. All right. I, I didn't uh, film breakfast this morning, but I did have the same thing as yesterday. So if you watched yesterday's vlog, uh, I had scrambled eggs with some spinach. I liked it so much, I just I made it again. It was really good. Um, so that was my nice, healthy breakfast. Lunch. Got my uh, tuna sandwich on the thin bread with flax. Actually, this is the uh, the multi-grain one. So this is a multi-grain thin bread, nice and healthy. I got a nice plum, which still is like rock solid. So I don't know if it's even ripe yet. Guess we'll find out. And I got my delicious Greek yogurt. Love the stuff. What do you love for lunch? What's your favorite lunch? What's your favorite thing to eat for lunch? Like healthy stuff. Because I need some new ideas. The sandwich, I have, I've had sandwiches a lot and um, leftovers is always good if I have leftovers. Um, I've been making smaller meals for dinner so I haven't had as many leftovers. So what, what kind of ideas do you have? Share with me. Help me. My lunches are great. I just need more variety. So what kind of lunch ideas do you have? Share that below. That'll be your your task for this video. Share your lunches. Alright, thanks. <laughs>